Mercury is very hot in its day side and very cold in its dark side. It has many craters because of its thin atmosphere. It takes only 88 days to revolve around the sun and 58 days to rotate on its axis. Venus. Venus is the hottest planet of all. It has no moons or rings and the sun rises at the west and sets at the east because it rotates in its axis backwards. Earth. About two thirds of the Earth is covered by water. The atmosphere is balanced with all the gases such as methane, hydrogen, oxygen, and carbon dioxide. And as we all know it, Earth is the only planet that supports life in our solar system. Mars is red in color because the surface of Mars is covered with iron oxide. This may have occurred because of rusting. Mars is thought to have supported life before 4.5 billion years, at which time it might have consisted water. The atmospheric oxygen and water rusted the iron in the surface, which made it look reddish over time. And the atmosphere is decaying so fast, that's because the core is slowly cooling down. Mars has two moons, which are Deimos and Phobos. Mars makes an orbit around the Sun in 687 Earth days. Jupiter Jupiter is a gas giant and is thought to have more than 75 moons. Jupiter takes 12 Earth years to complete one revolution. There is no way of landing on Jupiter because there is no solid surface. Saturn is also a gas giant and it has a ring system. Saturn's atmosphere is mostly hydrogen and helium. Saturn has 62 moons orbiting it. Few of the moons are inside the ring system and few are outside the ring system. Uranus Its blue and green color comes from the methane gas in the atmosphere. And Uranus is the first planet found with a telescope. The axis of Uranus is tilted 98 degrees. It takes 16 hours to rotate in its axis and 165 Earth days to orbit around the Sun. Neptune Neptune is the coldest planet in the solar system. Pluto Pluto is thought to be a planet until 2007 after which it went out of the solar system orbiting the Sun far away and is now recognized as a dwarf planet because of its smaller size. The New Horizon Space Telescope was the first man-made object to do a flyby to Pluto. Hope you got some information from this video and please like, share and subscribe to my channel. See you all in the next video. Thank you.